Hey YouTube, Nick Fury here. So you might have noticed something a little different about me. You guessed it, I'm wearing makeup, even though I told you I never wear makeup. But how do I look? Do I look good with makeup on? Do I look pretty enough for you now? And imagine, some girls have to wear makeup every day just to feel beautiful. Not me. Here's a little story all about how I messed up my eye. <laughs> so I was going to make this video about how I didn't shave for three years, but then I went to the urgent care yesterday and I decided I should probably make this video about why I'm wearing this eye patch. <laughs> I know, I know you didn't notice the makeup at first because the eye patch was a little more uh, out there. But yeah, this is what my face looks like when I do makeup. So, the eye patch. I don't know if you've noticed, but I wear glasses slash contacts. And let me set my timer for 10 minutes so I don't drone on, even though I, I probably will still drone on. So I got home from the temple and I took out my contacts. And this nail, see how my nails are really short? If you go back to one of my previous videos, you'll see that my nails are really long. I cut all of my nails down except for this one nail, and this nail is really pointy and sharp. And the reason I did that is because at work, we have to open a lot of pill packages, and they're really hard to open, so it's nice to have like one sharp nail. Little did I know it was going to cause a lot of pain. So I came home, and I took out my contacts. And I took out my right one, it was fine. I took out my left one and I had this like really sharp pain. And I went to sleep and I thought, well, and I woke up throughout the night in like really bad pain. And I was like, well, if I wake up in the morning and I'm still hurting, I'll go in and get it checked. So 1 p.m. rolls around and I'm still in a lot of pain. My left eye is swollen shut. I was supposed to go to work that night, couldn't because you kind of need two eyes to <laughs> assess. Um, I had called my mom on the phone just to ask her about it because, you know, whenever you're hurt, you call your mom. And she's like, yeah, it sounds like you should probably go to urgent care. I'm like, yeah, I probably should. So I show up to urgent care. Luckily, there was nobody there, so I didn't have to wait. Um, and I go in, and I'm thinking it's either, like, I irritated it somehow, I have pink eye. Because one of my friends had texted me, who farted on your pillow? Um... I just went through a lot of things in my head because I had like a pustule in my left ear so I thought maybe like an infection had spread to like my left eye. Um, my eyes, as a night nurse, my eyes just are really red all the time anyway because I don't adjust well to natural light because I sleep uh, during the day and I'm awake at night. So yeah, I just kept trying to, you know, since I'm a nurse I was trying to figure out what was wrong with my eye and then I get there and the nurse assesses me and you know my vision's really bad in this eye uh, with my glasses on because I'm legally blind without my glasses on but like this eye was fine but my vision was really bad in this eye and then I go lay down on the table and the doctor put like some numbing solution in my eye and he's like this is gonna sting and he put it in my eye and I was like um I don't feel that at all <laughs> so then he's like okay well I'm gonna put some dye in your eye to see like what exactly happened um, so this is my eye after the dye I put in and he had to use a blue light or a black light, excuse me. So if you can see the green, the little green part in my eye, you see where my pupil is and then there's that little green spot right there that's not supposed to be there. I had tore my cornea. So if you don't know the anatomy of an eye, it's pretty much like your eyeball is here, right, we'll say. And then there's this like clear covering called your cornea and then your pupil is like an open hole in your eye so that little black part of your eye is black because of it's a hole it's not because it's colored black and then there's your iris and retinas back here and all that but so pretty much this little clear part right here I had torn a hole in um, <laughs> and it wasn't very fun because the doctor after he saw it, he's like oh it's huge <laughs> So I was just really bummed because I don't know how long it's going to take for it to heal. Um, but I'm going to keep this eye patch on 
Hopefully it'll heal soon. I have to be, be putting antibiotics in it every four, four times a day. But yeah, that's my story on how I tore my cornea. You know, as a nurse, just everything sucks even more when you hurt yourself because you know exactly what happened and you know exactly what you're going to do to get better. So I can't even be like frustrated with it because I know what happened and I know how I'm going to fix it. I just wish I could be like other people who like, if other people this happened to their eye, they'd think it was like the end of the world. But don't care. Let's see, what else is I going to tell you? Take a good look because this is what I look like with the makeup on. Um, I think that's about it. I tried to work on my intro this time. I hope you liked it since you know I don't edit. Oh, and I really hope it's not blurry. I should have done that in the beginning of the video to make sure it's not blurry. I might buy something like a tripod or something to put my computer or my camera on, but pretty poor, so might not do that either. <laughs> If you have any questions about um, hurting your cornea or like contacts, I'm like a really good source for contacts. I've been wearing contacts for a really long time. So um, if you haven't worn contacts before, these are some good tips for you. One, wash your hands before you touch your eyes. Um, two, so when you put your contacts away, they're in that little, um, that little container. Make sure you replace the contact solution every time that you put your contacts in there. Um, three, you should probably throw away your contacts after two to three weeks because they say that's healthier for you. I don't really do that um, and I've never had an issue doing that but this is all my own fault. Like I pretty much scratched my own cornea. It had nothing to do with my contact hygiene. I have really good contact hygiene and I feel like I take really good care of my eyes except for right now. <laughs> except for today and yesterday. Um, yeah, I've actually transitioned to wearing my glasses more because um, working nights it's harder to keep contacts in because they get so dry. Most people don't even know I wear glasses or they don't know I wear contacts. It kind of depends on who you talk to. Like my work friends don't know I wear contacts and my friends, everyday life friends don't know I wear um, glasses or contacts because I have contacts in my eyes. But have a great day YouTube and this is Left Eye signing off. Also, side note, I joked with so many different people because my left eye has been, been getting red for the past two weeks. So I was just joking with people saying like, oh yeah, I'm left eye from TLC, it makes sense. Come to find out that joke bit me in the butt because now I am truly left eye. But I'll talk to you later.